Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. My name is Daisy. If you're new here, if you're not, hi, welcome back. But today I'm going to be doing a mukbang. This is a dakboki, and I just melted some cheese into it. And over here we have a uh, cheesy bulldog, bulldog pokumyeon, um, in the carbonara flavor. Mixing it all in. And for the drinks, I have a cup of water as well as a strawberry milk and a banana milk. I also have this thing which is a dakochi takoyaki kimari for the dakochi tuna kimbap which is a must sorry that was for the thumbnail but i'm also going to be answering some of your questions that i posted on my instagram as well so yeah but i'm really hungry right now because i didn't eat anything all day so i'm really excited for this video if you couldn't tell and on top of that, I was actually on a diet, and I really shouldn't be doing this while on a diet, but these are everything that I've been craving, so let me try the dakboki real quick. If you aren't aware, dakboki is like a rice cake thingy. Oh wow, these are huge. I got them from H Mart, if you are familiar with that. Mm. I love how they're so big. I actually have another rice cake product right over here, but this is a dakochi, which is a different sauce, I'm pretty sure. Mm. I love it. Kimbap. This is a tuna kimbap. This is making me miss Korea on my way. Mm. I was once watching this Korean variety show and there was this girl that was talking about her diet and she said you either go on a diet and give up your happiness for your looks or you trade happiness or you trade your looks for happiness and it couldn't be more true except everyone's beautiful but today's society is a little f so Mm. I'm gonna dip the kimari sauce in here. Mm. Have some banana milk. Why do I keep saying banana? It's banana. So I'm only going to be answering a few questions. Who and what inspires you the most? Um, there is this individual named Devon Carlson. Mm. And she is the owner of Wildflower Cases. I've already mentioned her name like 20 times on this channel and on my Instagram. But other than that, YouTuber wise, my family, because she's also from my city, it's just kind of cool to see the people in your same like surrounding like city get that big. You know, it's an inspiration for sure.
The camera really died, but we're back, so. I said that I would answer questions, but like, I'm too busy eating. I'll uh, answer those questions in another video. This is my favorite. This is a takoyaki. This is actually Japanese, not Korean. Disclaimer. <laughs> I actually can't eat as much as other mukbangers, obviously, because I'm not a mukbanger. But I just wanted to take this time to just eat with y'all. So a lot of you guys told me that you guys tend to eat when you guys watch my videos, so I thought that would be cool. On my final kimbap, I've had most of the food. I'm almost finished everything. Mm -hmm. I'm gonna save this for next time. I'm really satisfied. I think I can finally go back to my diet now. Well, I hope you guys enjoyed this mukbang. It's something that I normally don't do, but I plan on doing more in the future because I like watching mukbangs and I think it's cool and dope. So be sure to follow up my social media on my Instagram and as well as on my Snapchat if you want to message me. But on my Instagram, I do go live on a weekly basis, I'd say. So make sure you stay updated for that. And make sure you subscribe and become part of the family and help me get to 100,000 because that'd be so amazing. Um, well, I hope you guys enjoyed this video and you guys can always come back to this video to watch while you're eating or whatever. So I shall see you guys in a few days. <laughs> Bye. Woke up at 11 o'clock, I ain't got no job, what the hell should I do today? This feel like some I don't give a fuck, oh my god, shut the fuck up, I ain't hearing what you gotta say. What the deal, how you feel, not important, all I'm thinking about.